your beans and make sure your jars are clean. Okay, and then um, I'm using pint-sized jars. Just take your beans and snip the ends off of them. And then we're just gonna stick them in the jar like so. And some of them may be too long, so you'll just have to snip off the excess. Okay, so pack them in the jar so they look nice like that. Okay, now I'm going to add a little bit of dill. I grew my own this year so and dried my own. I'll put a link right here if you want to learn how to do that. So I'm just going to add about this much to every jar and then you'll want an eighth a teaspoon of red pepper flakes and I also grew and dried these myself as well so I'll put a link for how to do that right here I also decided to pickle some garlic so I did that the same way I put it in the smaller jars the half pint jars and I also added a habanero pepper and a uh, what's the other one? Serrano pepper just for some color make it look prettier in the jar bring two cups of distilled water two and a half cups distilled white vinegar A fourth of a cup of sea salt and one teaspoon of garlic salt to a boil. And then add that boiling brine to your jars. Cover, cover up the beans to about a quarter inch from the top. Wipe the rims off of your jars. Uh, make sure to get anything that may be on there because if there's any debris, then your lids aren't gonna seal. Boil your lids. Okay, add, put your lid on your jar. Put the ring on firmly tight. Okay, load your jars into your boiling water bath and make sure they're covered by an inch of water. Um, we're gonna cook the beans for, we're just gonna simmer them. We're not gonna bring them to a rolling boil. And we're gonna do that for 10 minutes. And then we'll leave the gar we'll take the beans out. We'll leave the garlic in there and bring those to a full rolling boil for 10 minutes. Hey, okay, this is what a simmer looks like. It's got some steam coming out, but it's not boiling and it's got those little bubbles all over. So I set the timer for 10 minutes. Okay, it's been 10 minutes, so I'm going to take the beans out and just set them on a towel to cool. Okay, and I left the garlic in there and I turned my temperature up to high so we can get a full rolling boil. This is what a full rolling boil Ow, looks like. So I'm going to set the timer for 10 minutes. Once they've cooled, you can test if they seal by pushing on the lid. And if it doesn't move at all, then that means it's sealed. So these are all sealed. 
and then I'm just going to write on them what they are. 